This video is a step-by-step -step demonstration of how to use knowledge of human anatomy to draw a standing male figure. We will continue with the same model, Michelangelo's David. In the previous two videos, you learned how to construct a figure in contrapposto, as well as the skeletal anatomy of the human body. A virtual line can be drawn between the nipples on the male chest, one-fourth of the way down from the top of the figure. You can double-check this proportion by comparing the distance between the nipple line and the lower jaw, which should be the same as the height of the head. The biceps brachii muscle occupies the front portion of the upper arm. It has two heads, which originate at the shoulder blade and an insert into the upper part of the forearm bones. The main function of this muscle is to flex the forearm. The lower arm has two main groups of muscles, the flexors and the extensors. These muscles can rotate together with radius bone, which runs alongside the elbow bone. In the pronation position, the radius crosses the elbow bone from above. In the supination position, these two bones are parallel to each other. In this drawing, you can see that David's right forearm is in the pronation position. I will now shade tonal values in red pencil to reveal the three-dimensional nature of the model. Sit back and enjoy the demonstration. 